<laughs> Reese Garvin and Jaden Ware. Let's try this again with us here at center court. So, Reese, I'll ask you the same question I asked you before. Early foul trouble. Your coach put you back in the game. You hit a couple big buckets late in that first quarter, extended the lead. How did you stay disciplined, and what did it feel like in that moment? to be able to play in that situation and make the big shots. No, it felt great that my coach had the trust to put me back in the game even when I had the two fouls. And, you know, we live for these moments. We were here last year, so it's just great to get back out here and get another state win. Jaden, your coach told us that you have really stepped into this role, particularly in postseason play. And as a sophomore, you're, you have a full season under you. Now you're playing more like a junior. Have you felt comfortable in postseason play? And if so, why? Um, I think it was the experience that I got last year on varsity as a uh, freshman. And um, even though I didn't play that much, I came in at cr uh, like critical um, points in the game. And I just like to be a game changer, like to help the team out. I want to get to the next step. Your play, uh, particularly on loose balls and those two key steals down the stretch were really the difference. When you're getting into the passing lane and when you're playing defense, you know what is the key to that anticipation that you so clearly have? Um, it's like it's like watching the eyes. Like I play football, I play receiver, I play DB. You're just watching the eyes, and you know, like you're taking the right step. You have to anticipate it, and you always have to be one step ahead of the other, uh, the other player. Reese, your coach called you one of the best, maybe the best shooter in Berks County. That's got to feel good. That confidence that you have. It looked like the rim was an ocean here tonight with the, all the threes that you hit. Um, how did it feel to come to Philadelphia here tonight, and, and what was the difference for you this evening? No, it felt great. I like showing out in the you know, away games. It's, I like to silence the crowd rather than you know, bring up like a home crowd. I don't know, it's just more fun to me. So going out there and like, hitting those shots, and the game was pretty dead in the first half. So it was a great feeling to have it like that. Last one for you guys. I know you're going to enjoy this one for a little bit, but uh, if Imhotep is able to come out and win today, you'll have a rematch of the state final. You guys want another shot at Imhotep? Of course. I mean, we don't, we're not going to duck smoke with anyone. You know, we want to go out and play against anyone. So it will be a fun experience again. You know, one of the best, if not the best team in the state. So it will be fun to play against. Jaden Ware and Reese Garvin, thank you so much for doing this. Enjoy this one, and congrats on a wonderful effort. Thank you, thank you very much. We'll hang around here, guys, real quick, and we'll see if we can grab Jeff Van Gore. You got a second for us, Jeff. Congrats, guys. Head coach of Exeter Township, Jeff Van Gorder. Some heart and soul from that team to withstand that run, even take on a deficit at one point, and then answer in the game's final moments. Yeah, that was uh, that was a roller coaster. Um, you know, I knew, you know, UD was really good. I know they're really good at their pressure. We've done a really good job breaking pressure all year. This is a different type of pressure. Um, you know, I think. We asked our main guys to play a lot, and I think, you know, there were some things that didn't go our way in the third quarter. You know, like, it is what it is. We get a strip at half court, calls a foul, you know, stops the play. But I think we overcame some adversity, which we talk about. You know, like you said, we're down two. Jaden misses a layup, hustles back, blocks that shot, then gets another big steal. Um, I'm just super proud of everybody that played. It's it, it was it was fun to see. We talked before the contest, and you talked about Jaden how the steps that he has taken, particularly in postseason play. And that's the thing, you get this much basketball in you, you're a sophomore, you're, you're basically a junior now, and he is playing unbelievable basketball, disruptive defensively, great on the glass. Yeah, he, he does an awesome job doing all the things that help you win games. You know, like if he wasn't in the game today, I don't know how many points he scored, maybe it was only that basket at the end, but he impacted the game on the defensive end. Um, to help us make winning plays. So didn't hang his head. Um, you know, offensively, he's been really good for us too. You know, they play a, an aggressive trapping and you can't really call a bunch of things, you know? So um, he did an awesome job. I'm super proud of him. He's a sophomore that's gonna be like a senior next year. So happy for him. This team that you have, one thing that stuck out to our guys up there, tough. A very tough group of guys. Grab the ball with two hands off the glass. Tough on the dribble willing to accept contact when going to the rim. It's got to be a fun group of guys to coach in an environment like this. It is, man. It, it, I mean, I say it in every interview, like, we got competitors. They compete every single day. It starts with the seniors. I, I mean, I can't speak enough about Reese Garvin tonight. Um, you know, Reese has done everything for us this year. Um, and today, like, made a lot of tough shots, hit a tough shot, got fouled when we were down two, hit a tough one. Um, you know, I think gets to the rim and gets fouled sometimes. Um, guards the other team's best 
bigs and I tell you what like 30 is really good like he's a really good high school basketball player and Reese did a really good job on him today so it starts with the seniors they're competitors and it makes it a lot of fun to go to practice every day and I'm glad we get more practices get more practices it's your first year so you weren't on the bench for this one but if Imhotep wins the contest tonight which they're I would argue the favorite tonight you'll get a rematch of the state final pretty cool for these kids yeah yeah it's cool like I said you know roll them out we'll play um, see what happens. Thank you so much for doing this. Congrats on coming down here in a hostile environment and extending your season. It was a lot of fun. Thank you guys for the coverage on all the high school kids. It's, it's really cool to see. Congrats, and we'll see you down the road, Jack. Thanks. I appreciate it. Thank you, guys. Yep.